everybody, it's day two at Bauma and we're talking with Caterpillar again about their um, advanced power portfolio. And we are talking with AJ Prasher and Alistair Dennis. And uh, AJ, what was the motivation for Caterpillar to launch the battery as part of your advanced power portfolio? I think it's a really interesting time for the industry. Um, decarbonization is becoming more and more important and so uh, with battery electric machines there's opportunities to reduce your scope one emissions which is the emissions directly from the work site. There's also opportunity to reduce scope two emissions which is the, which is the emissions and the carbon within the fuel itself. And then secondly if we look at productivity of the machine uh, we can run low noise, we can uh, run on cheap renewable electricity potentially. And then also you've got options to uh, eliminate the air filters and fuel filters to help reduce the overall um, maintenance costs and servicing costs. That's great. And Alistair, could you uh, tell us a little bit of the technical information about the battery? Sure. So uh, we've got three different types of battery on display. So uh, one of them here today. Uh, we have a 48 volt, a 300 volt and a 600 volt battery solution and they cover different kilowatt hours or capacity, so 32 kilowatt hours in the smaller range and 64 for the 300 and 600 volt. Uh, we've designed them as uh, a lithium ion based uh, concept uh, with a modular approach to design, so a lot of commonality between those packs uh, and then you can use those in a variety of different um, applications and machine types and industries. Um, and moving from 48 to 600 volts just gives you a big range and then you can put together multiple packs per machine or just one depending on what you need. Uh, so it's a very flexible solution designed very much for the off-highway uh, industry. Again, great at this off-highway and flexibility is key. In what equipment can these batteries be used? What are some applications for them? Yeah, so some examples, we're very much focused around construction, industrial, off-highway markets. So it's designed to be robust, durable, in those kind of arduous applications that we see in dusty environments, wet environments. Uh, harsh environments and so things like uh, you'll start to see around the show in other stands things like medium wheeled loaders, compact wheeled loaders, small excavators and large excavators all having some of those packs in them uh, and you'll see multiple packs in some of them as they get larger machines. What else should viewers know about this newly launched battery technology that you're showing here at Bauma? Yep so battery electric machines have been around us for a number of years I think there are a couple of key challenges uh, one, in terms of the affordability of batteries. Uh, secondly, in terms of their life cycle. And I think that's where Caterpillar is really focused, is making sure the design and development of these and the application helps customers to be um, more affordable. And then secondly, through our global dealer network, uh, making sure these batteries are appropriately supported. Each battery comes with a telematics kit, which enables us to monitor it, make sure it's operating efficiently um, and safely. And so overall, I say Caterpillar is pretty well positioned to support customers through their energy transition. Thank you both so much for talking with us today. We were happy to speak with you, and we hope you have a great rest of the show. Thank you. Thanks.